I just want you to get down. Please, please sir, I'm just asking for an explanation. Stop just... talking. Do you hear me? Whose car is this? This is my car. Okay? I bought this car. This car okay. is paid. Shut up. Come here. Don't fucking so, move not... or I'll put a bullet through your head. You understand me? Don't fucking move. Sorry about that. Um, no worries. I'll have whatever whatever she's having. Of course. Uh, may I see your ID? Yes, of course. <sighs> Great. Thank you, Mr. Sani. Should I be worried? <sighs> um. I uh. I got pulled over today. I, mean, I don't know. This this time it was it was different. I mm -hmm. I didn't know if I was gonna walk out of there alive. You know, like my whole life just flashed before my eyes, and and all I could think about was what did you do? Why, why is that always the first fucking question? What did you do? Why did? What are you talking about? See, this, this, this is why I wasn't gonna say anything because somehow I, I knew, somehow I knew that you would react this are way. Are you kidding me? You know what? I, I know what I did, and I know what I'm not. Okay, well, everyone who looks at you knows that you're not just a kid from Compton. I'm sorry, what in the hell is that supposed to mean? Hmm? Okay, sorry. Yeah, we get it. You are very oppressed. Justin, I wasn't trying to insinuate that you were at fault. Well, that sure is how what it sounds like. I mean, what the fuck else does what did you do supposed to mean, huh? Besides, what does it even matter whether or not I did anything? I'm trying to tell you that my life was in the balance, Christina. Babe, I'm not blaming. I was just saying. I'm trying to tell I've had to be twice as good. No, 10 times as good to get half as far. Stop trying to quiet me, OK? I don't give a fuck about these people, OK? How would you feel if you were had to go through this crap day in and day out and were told not to feel what you feel? Shame. Fear, confusion, all these things. All these things that I'm not allowed to even have the human experience as a black man. How would you feel? Forget it. I, all I know is that I didn't have these conversations all the damn time with my ex. Oh, because you're an expert on black lives now? Thank you. Here you go. <sighs> Thank you. <sighs> oh, shit. I'm so sorry. I just... Is everything okay? No, every everything's fine. I would just uh, had, an, had an accident. Sorry about can we that. Get some paper towels. Um, would you like to move to another table? Uh, yeah, we can move. No, no. Honestly, the check. I think is. I think we want the check. Yeah. I'm so sorry. You know what? I, uh, okay. I'll see you later, okay? Are you kidding me? I will Sit see down. you later. Wait, you're not sorry.
Justin. Justin. Just... Wait, why are you walking away from me? Just, I just need him. Stop, stop, okay? Just stop what? Stop. You know what this looks like. Can we just drive, please? Mama, see the sure seen piss back there. <laughs> don't mean to step out of line, but uh, if you don't mind me asking, she worth the fight? I'm so tired of fighting in general, man. I just, I don't know. If nothing ever changes, then is the fight even worth it? You know, if you're passionate about something, absolutely the fight's worth it. Hey. Hey, hey, we missed my turn back there. Hell, okay, I'll just go around, man. Sorry. What did you do back there? <laughs> Nothing. Besides fearing for my life, I did absolutely nothing. Us humans, we're uh, we're like screwed up. You know? We don't really know how we feel. So how are we supposed to know how you feel? Um, you can uh, you can pull over over here. Try to remember that uh, your experience is yours. If she's worth it, then fight for her empathy. Yeah. Hey, uh, <clears throat> have a good night. Hey. Don't forget, huh? I want a five-star rating. saying that I, I, I don't do anything wrong, okay? <laughs> but I'm saying that that same compassion that I've seen extended to, to, to white rapists and murderers and terrorists, Nazis, I don't get that same compassion for myself. And you say things like, at least you're not just some kid from Compton, right? Like, and I get it, I have been born on second base. <laughs> I've had it better than most, I understand that. But that doesn't always mean it's easier. In fact, sometimes it's harder because it means that I've had, I have to fight from both sides. I'm constantly having to negotiate my existence. And it's exhausting. I'm sorry, Justin. Life is unfair. I know. But there's unfairness. And then there's the fact that I have to know that at, at a routine traffic stop that my life could be snuffed out. I negotiate too. Every time I'm alone with a man, I wonder if he's gonna jump me. What I wear, where I walk, when I walk, you know my journey. My addiction, my anxiety, my fucked up family. 
but somehow I'm here. So sometimes it's just hard for me to tap into this privilege that you tell me that I have. Justin, I'm sorry. I can't be you. I know, I know, and, and I'm not, you don't have to be, but you do have to understand that out there, for me, they get to be judge, jury, execution. I am not them. No. But you do share their privilege. I don't have an answer.